Hi there, Aries. This is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm going to be doing your July 2017 general reading. Whatever is meant to come up will cut out, come up. So I just want to inform you that when I do my readings, I can't speak. It happens to me all the time. So I don't know if it's too much energies or what, but the words don't come out as they should. So thank you so much for all the subscriptions, the comments, the watchers, and the bookings. I appreciate that. If this doesn't resonate with you, check your moon sign or your rising sign. Um, this is for Aries, July 2017, and this is a general reading. What do you have for Aries? I shuffle until the cards tell me stop. Because they want to be seen, and while I was shuffling, I was hearing that you are resisting something. You are resisting something. You just don't want to go, or you do want to go. It's about wanting to go. You're just you don't you don't want to go, but you do want to go. That's what I'm hearing. You don't want to go, but you do want to go. <laughs> That's confusing, isn't it? You're definitely thinking a lot, you know, you're worrying, you might be a little depressed. Um, perhaps something's been coming for a while and you see it and you've been waiting for it. Um, something is finally coming that you've been expecting, alright? Could have something to do with a um, Taurus, Capricorn or Virgo or a Cancer person. But I see it as um, moving forward. Okay, you're moving forward. You're moving toward. You're moving forward with the plans, with your dreams. Okay, you're replacing fear, um, and you're moving forward. You're not being. You're not as scared as you used to be about something. Your mental strength has. Um, Increased. You're not as scared as you used to be. You're not as scared to move forward as you thought. Um, but you've been worried about it. It's caused some depression. It's something about moving forward. I think that there is a plan and you are scared to, to do it. Um, okay. But it's very practical. Okay. It's practical. It is... Um, it's secure. It's stable. Wherever you're going to, it's stable and it's secure. It's what you're looking for. It is. Um, and you, you're so close to being there. You really are. You're so, so, so close to your wishes being fulfilled. I mean, you're almost there, Aries, to your wishes being fulfilled. You're moving forward. Something's been in the works for a while, and you kind of want to go, but you kind of don't. A little bit of fear, you know, but you're replacing fear with um, faith. You're replacing fear with faith.
perhaps things, um, perhaps you've been a little too um, hasty in your approach, okay? Or cruel, you know, this person can be cruel. You are moving forward. Maybe you've maybe you've been cruel to yourself. I don't know. What is this? Maybe you you've been angry with yourself. Or you it's about you, okay? This is about you and you you're moving forward and you I don't know. You're in denial or something? You've been in denial or you've been beating yourself up over it or something like that. Or somebody's not supporting your move. Somebody's not supporting your path to to um, happily ever after. Somebody isn't supporting your, ha your path to your wishes being fulfilled. They could be jealous of your, of your path. We're going to get some more. Something is going on behind the scenes that you don't know about. That's why this card is here. That makes sense. Could be some smack talk going on, per se. I don't know where smack talk came from. I don't think I've ever used that word ever in my whole life. So, this is for the month of July. Looks like... Um, You've definitely had a time of worry and introspection and you've gone deep within regarding this, this forward movement that you've been waiting to take that you're iffy about. You're iffy about taking it, but um, you've definitely thought about it good and hard. All aspects, okay? Up and down, all around. You've covered every corner, all right? And now it's time to choose. The fork is in the road and it's time to choose. Which path are you going to take? Are you going to move forward or are you going to stay stuck here? That is the question. All right. Follow your intuition. That's what this is about. Okay. Expertise, insight, intelligence. You have thought about it enough. You know what to do. Okay. You do, Aries. You've thought about it enough. You know what to do. And when you finally move forward, it's a new experience. One cycle of your existence is ended and another one begins. It's a major, major completion. Major. When you finally choose to go or not to go. It's funny. Do you want to go or do you not want to go? Remember when I was shuffling the cards and that came out? I mean, come on now. What is it? wishy-washy but anyway it's time to make a decision it's time to choose which which road to take do you go left or do you do right because right now is the time this is the month of july so by the third week you might be even closer all right um you need to have faith and trust and i think i, I said that earlier that you have replaced your fear with faith or you're going to replace your fear with faith okay it doesn't matter what's going on behind the scenes because faith takes care of it. Don't beat yourself up. Don't underestimate yourself. Don't pull yourself down. Move forward with faith. Let go of the fear because it leads to your wishes being fulfilled. Okay? This is your wishes being fulfilled once you get rid of fear and anger. Okay? Don't worry about any of this. Don't worry about any betrayal. Whatever's going on behind the scenes is going on behind the scenes. Okay? You're moving forward with confidence and courage and enthusiasm and an optimism. This is by the end of the second week. You know, you're feeling really enthusiastic about your dreams. Okay? 
we're moving on to the third week, that's when you might finally, you know, you dream by the end of the second week, you're so enthusiastic. By the beginning of the third week, you are okay. Now I might, I might take a step down that road. I might take a step, or I might even go all the way by the third week of July. You might even go to the end of the road, because when you get to the end of the road, is right here. Then the cycle is finally, the wheel has turned. One cycle has ended and another cycle begins. And you will be recognized for it. Okay? You'll be recognized. Because of, of who you are, what you did, what you've accomplished. Okay? This is betrayal, deception, okay? And it's connected to you. It's connected to where you are moving on. And it's something going on. Perhaps you're not aware of something. You are not aware of something. You're not. There's nothing you can do about it, so just don't even worry about it. I, You know, I wish I didn't have to tell you this card. You know, because if you weren't aware of it, why, why even become aware of it? Unfortunately, I just made you aware of it because that's what this card is. Betrayal and deceit. I can't change it into something different. There's somebody who is against you and they've been playing a game. Or doesn't want to see this happen. You know, doesn't want to see your success. It's probably, this is an air sign. Or they are very uh, jealous of you. Air sign. Um, Gemini. Libra. Aquarius. Fake. Anyway, don't worry about that because you have enthusiasm. You have optimism. You have growth. You have confidence. You have courage. And you are headed towards your dreams believe it or not your wishes have been fulfilled and that makes you feel really good so whatever this betrayal is this is towards the end of the third week there's some kind of um, deceit deceit it's in the works in the second week by the end of the third week it's it's here you you be, it becomes known But that's after you start your new chapter and you are recognized, you know. Then there's some kind of something going on behind the scenes that you didn't know about. That's all there is to it. There's something going on behind the scenes that you were unaware of. But by the end of the third week, it should come to light, whatever it is. So the fifth week, I mean the fourth week, I don't know where the fifth week came from. There's not even five weeks in a month, very seldom, so who knows. Um, like I said, when I do my readings, I don't even know what comes out of my mouth. It's just amazing. So anyway, um, this is a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and they're on the other side of this wheel. Okay. They're not over here. They're over here. So perhaps they're, they are, um, you know, they're, maybe they helped you on this journey. On this journey they helped you with, you know. And now something is happening. The wheel is spinning and it goes to the ultimate abundance. It goes to, um, it's decision time. Okay, it's the finality. It's the final decision time. It's final. Okay, something is final. It's your own justice. Perhaps finding out about that, that deceit or that betrayal brings you the truth. Towards the end of the fourth week, you know, 
something is final and it um, it's good it's good whatever it is it's good because this is the ultimate home life your home life is a very very abundant with everything love contentment prosperity stability security everything okay and you're proud and you're happy and you're recognized probably for your loyalty because you're so loyal all right and the truth comes out at the end of the month something is final and some kind of decision has been made by the end of the month okay Let's get a couple clarification cards for Aries for the month of July. I see that you're starting a new chapter with faith, no fear, and you feel good about it. You feel proud. All right. And whatever this, this deceit is, or lies, or whatever the hell it is, it's, it's very minor, okay? This water sign down here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, they, on the, they are on the other side of the wheel. So they either helped you get to this spot, or... Um, they're, they're part of your plan. They're part of your future. They're part of your journey, put it that way. And they can be quite supportive. I think they have helped you on the journey. And <laughs> You've come, come into your own. We have it twice. That's why I did that. And now, okay, I'll get to this in a minute. I can't see. I tried to talk too fast because so many things come in. You've come into your own. New partnerships or contracts. Continue to move forward. We already talked about this way back in this reading. Continue to move forward. You are moving forward. Now, before I lose this thought, twos are about faith and trust. When you see three twos, two, 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 it's about faith and trust. Have faith and trust, and you're no fear, no fear. Two, two, two. No fear. Have faith and trust. Two, two, two. No fear, no fear, no fear. Have faith and trust. Do it. Beautiful. It's true. Once you move forward, you feel so good, it's time for a celebration. It is. And a recognition. This is a recognition. So a celebration and a recognition. And this is to the set this is second to third week of the month, these cards are. <clears throat> and this one's gonna go right here. Seven of Cups, a complex decision, the need to do research, search, stop procrastinating. Maybe you're deceiving yourself. This card goes right here. That's Maybe you're deceiving yourself by not being balanced, okay? It's time to make a decision and get balanced. Make the, make the decision. Are you going to go or are you not going to go? A complex decision, the need to do research. Stop procrastinating. Come on. That's you deceiving yourself. Not listening. Not letting go. So I can't think of anything else to say for your, for your month of July, Aries. Um, this pretty much sums it up. I think that you need to make a final decision and you're going to do it by the end of the month. 
and something is going to be final and you are moving forward. You're moving forward to a wonderful spot in your life. Absol absolutely wonderful. Okay? It's time to start a new chapter. You are going to start a new chapter. Alright? And continue to move forward. Everything looks good. We The biggest message of this reading for the month of July for Aries is to replace fear with faith. Now, what did I just say anyway? What's the biggest message? I hear it, do you? What was the message I just told you that was the biggest message? What was it? Replace fear with faith. One more time. Replace fear with faith. Replace fear with faith. Replace fear with faith. 